Hey, thanks for joining me. I'm just a fellow who loves beer, and today I'll be drinking my 455th different beer, Lake of Bays Brewing Company's Old North Mocha Porter. Just off the top of the bottle, we have the Lake of Bays cap. A little bit of a pour, a little bit of a head. Wonderful, rich, dark mocha color to that. They're located in Baysville, Ontario, and were established in 2008. This is their winter seasonal release. Off the bottle, best enjoyed with a hearty meal and a nip in the air, this porter derives its rich character from roasted barley chocolate malts, and locally roasted coffee. Bold and robust, Old North Mocha Porter is a faithful expression of the intrepid frontier spirit. In partnership with Diesel House Coffee Roasters, and the ingredients listed are water, malted barley, hops, and coffee. Off their site, pours almost black with beautiful creamy mocha-colored foam. Yeah, I'd agree with that. Upon further inspection, the colors are actually deep ruby, garnet, and dark brown. The aromas include cappuccino, mocha, chocolate, and vanilla with a hint of molasses and pie crust. The flavors include subtle sweetness with dark chocolate, mild coffee, and tiramisu. The mouthfeel is dry, fairly mild, with some initial sweetness. And the finish is medium to moderate bitterness, that lingers and delivers a nice coffee profile that arrives quite late. This beer clocks in at 5.2%, and it looks freaking beautiful. I'm very impressed with this. It looks... wow. Can we get any of that color? A very little bit. Let's give it a try. Wow, wow, wow. Wow. <laughs> uh, what I gathered from it, explosive coffee on the nose. Not like cartoon violence, just right there. Uh, yes, you can nose through it and pick out the coffees they had mentioned. It smells absolutely brilliant. Like a coffee shop with fingernail marks clawed into the floor because people just don't want to leave. Uh, just as intense as the aroma, the taste floods malt, coffee, chocolate, molasses, toffee, cappuccino, nice bitters, mocha, burnt caramel, wide awake at 2 a.m., fall, 70% coca uh, chocolate. I didn't get the pie crust, but their tasting notes are pretty spot on. It lingers, it fades, you want more, it's delicious. On my metric system, I'll give it a 3. Horde. Better than meh good, and excellent, a beer that I would stock and hoard in an unreasonable fashion. Excellent beer. Great job, guys. Cheers.